are robots about to take over the worldwide famous culinary art of pizzas? This is what French startup Ekim believes with its brand new concept of a pizza robot. Usually seen in factories, this robot is capable of spreading tomato sauce on the pizza base, put the pizza in the oven, take a cardboard box and cut the pizza. The robot gestures have been synchronized on those of real life. From the art of spreading the dough to the technique of putting oil and pepper on top of a steaming pizza. Able to perform several tasks at once with its three arms, inventors say the pizza-making robot can deliver a pizza every 30 seconds and up to 120 an hour, when a simple human reaches at best 40 pizzas an hour. But it's not all about being fast. All the ingredients offered to the customers are organic and carefully selected in France and Italy. Robots allow customers to personalize their pizzas at any time of the day, even up to 2 a.m. There is something quite amazing and new which can't be done in fast food or traditional restaurants. This is what robots bring. It allows for a totally new experience. It also reassures clients in a rush. People nowadays have less and less available time to eat. They hardly have 30 minutes to have lunch. Therefore, they have to choose between time and food quality. And what we're doing is providing both. The idea sprouted in the heads of two French engineers as they were still in university. Fed up with eating low-quality fast foods, the only meals they could afford at the time, they started thinking about a solution which could reconcile rapidity and quality at any hour of the day. Oddly, we're not faster than a pizzaiolo as we make a pizza in 4 minutes and 30 seconds. Because the pizzas are made on demand in front of the customer, we take time to cook them well to put the ingredients. But the robots have three arms. They can coordinate their tasks and make several pizzas at once. So yes, making a pizza takes 4 minutes and 30 seconds. But we deliver one pizza every 30 seconds, which allows us to deliver 120. As one would a traditional vending machine serving coffee or snacks, the concept will allow anyone to order a freshly cooked pizza at any time of the day or night. But at the Oskia Pizzeria in central Paris, the chef is made of flesh. Neapolitan born and bred, Vittorio Monti has golden hands and the pizzas that come out of his oven as close as it gets to pizza heaven. His art, he says, cannot be reproduced by a robot. No, no. No, no. The future can be a robot for pizza. Pizza is a tradition. The tradition for pizza is that it's made by hand. Though he admits a human being will always cost more than a robot, there's no way a robot can adapt to the living ingredients he uses every day. Humans are faster. He can tell if the dough is good or not, if there are any problems. The dough can have problems if the temperature changes. If there are any problems, the robot can't tell. The robot pizza hasn't left its showroom just outside of Paris, but Ekim's currently looking for a place in the French capital to install their autonomous restaurant and plan to franchise their concept as soon as 2019 for it to cross the French border into Europe and the rest of the world. The first batch of 5G commercial system equipment conformed to the first phase of international 5G standards and will be launched within this year. China has already mastered relevant key technology such as large-scale antenna and network coding and the country will speed up its test run. <laughs> We would keep promoting 5G technology research and development tests to ensure that China will see the first batch of commercial system equipment that conforms to the first phase of international 5G standard this year. We, we, would, we would also complete the third phase system networking test in time. 
According to China's Vice Minister of Industry and Information Technology, efforts will be made to develop systems, chips, terminals and gauges in order to form a complete industry chain, laying a foundation for comprehensive commercial use. He added that policies on the commercial use of 5G technology will be released and frequently spectrum planning and licensing for commercial use will also be issued. The application of 5G in areas such as industry, energy and transportation is also encouraged.